Hello everyone. I welcome you all to ATM Creations. This is a 20 inch MDF base in which I found the center, drew random circles and uh, created grids. The angles are marked at every 15 degree like 15, 30, 45 etc. Uh, the same way I have marked the angles and created grids in this part of the circle too. In this dot mandala creation I am planning to give some tips for fellow dot artists so stay tuned till the end let's get started with dotting now i'll start with dotting in the center in gold now i'll keep tiny golden dots when i dip this tool into the paint i dip only the ball side of the tool so that i pick up less amount of paint and the size of the dot can be consistently similar Earlier I have done the mistake of dipping the entire tool into the paint and keeping some 2-3 dots in one go. So what happens is uh, the dots won't be similar in size and I used to wonder why the size is not similar. So all we need is some patience and dip only the tip of the tool in the paint not the entire tool. Now I will keep some lemon yellow dots. Now I will keep some tiny dots. Now I will keep some chrome yellow dots. When I pick a paint and keep a dot, I will make sure I don't touch the surface so that the paint drops off automatically. I will keep two side swipes in chrome yellow. When you are keeping thin swipe and for a shorter distance, you need to be really conscious about the amount of paint you pick up else you can't get beautiful swipe. I'll keep some dots in golden yellow now. Now I'm dotting within the grid so it's becoming very easier for me now. I'll keep tiny dots in golden yellow. See when you rotate the board for uh, painting in a different uh, angle, if the paint is thick it is fine or if the paint is little thin then you need to be really slow in rotating the board otherwise if you rotate it faster the dot may move here and there. And this rotating technique is not only for the MDF board, it's for any painting surface. Now I'll keep some dots in cream yellow. Now tiny dots time. I'm going to tiny dot in cream yellow. For tiny dotting, I choose the tool depending on the space that I have between any two dots. So here the space is big, so I chose a bigger tool. Now I'll keep some orange dots. Now I'll keep two side swipes in orange. I'll keep some tiny golden dots now.
I'll keep some golden dots now. Few people do ask me how to get a perfect dot and this is what I do. I pick up a lot of paint and then I don't press it hard on the surface. I wait until the paint drops off automatically and then give a gentle press on the paint itself, not on the surface. So that requires a lot of patience and I do that for each and every dot. I'll keep some dots with lemon yellow now. Now I'll keep some golden dots. I'll work the dots in chrome yellow now. Now I'll work the dots in gold. I'll keep some orange dots now. I'll keep some straight swipes in lemon yellow. I'll keep a plumpy dot then make it to a swipe. Now I'll make these dots into swipes. For keeping these plumpy dots also, I pick up a lot of paint and then wait until the paint drops off. If you clearly notice, my dotting tool doesn't touch the surface at all. Now I'll keep two side swipes in orange. I'll keep a dot then make it to a swipe. How much amount of paint you pick up for keeping a plumpy dot depends on whether your paint is thin or thick. If your paint is creamy consistency you may have to take a little more paint. If it is thin you have to take a little less. I'll keep some golden dots. To me, this mandala looks beautiful already. 
what do you think about it let me know in the comments now i'm going to keep some chrome yellow dots I'll keep some golden dots. I'll walk the dots in chrome yellow. I'll walk the dot second layer. Now I'll work the dots in gold. Now I'll keep some straight swipes in chrome yellow. I'm going to keep a dot and then make it to a swipe. I'm keeping less amount of paint this time because the swipe has to be smaller. Now I'll make these dots into swipes. Now I'll keep two side swipes in orange. I will keep some golden dots now. Now I'll keep some dots in golden yellow.
I'll keep some golden dots now. I'll work the dots in golden yellow now. I'll walk the dot second layer in golden yellow too. Now I'll work the dots in gold. Now I'll keep some orange dots. Now I'll keep straight swipes in golden yellow. I'll keep a plumpy dot then make it to a swipe. Now I'll make these dots into swipes. Now I'll keep two side swipes in orange. I'll keep plumpy dot and then make it to a swipe. I'll make these dots into swipes now. I'll keep some golden dots now.
Now I'll keep some dots and cream yellow. Now I'll work the dots and cream yellow. Now I'll work the dot second layer in golden yellow. Now I'll keep some golden dots. Now I'll work the dots in gold. Now I'll keep some orange dots. Now I'll keep some straight swipes in cream yellow. I'll keep plumpy dot and make it to a swipe. Now I'll make these dots into swipes. Now I'm keeping plumpy dot, I'll make it to a swipe later. I'll make these dots into swipes now.
I'm sure this dot mandala looks really vibrant. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you.